Yesterday I was like, ooh, I think you're, you meaning my lungs, are not quite as bad as yesterday. And today I think it's like, oh yeah. Good morning, guys. Here's what's happening right now at the Fry House. Mary's feeling, what are you feeling? Puke. Puke? Nauseous? Mm -hmm. I just took Zofran. Okay. Did you just take medicines or something? Or? I did. Okay. So she and Ollie are having a little snuggle. Where's the cat? He's up in his bed. He's in his bed? Okay. We just got a delivery from Sam's Club. We did because Mary and I are trying not to leave the house at all. Um, even for grocery shopping. We did a month membership of Instant Cart and so that's been a huge blessing to be able to... $10. Yeah, it was ten dollars for 30 days and we can order... I think you have to order thirty five dollars and then it's free delivery for a month. So that's been a huge blessing so we ordered some milk and some fruit and we're running low on meats in our freezer so we got three pounds of ground beef and so we should be set for oh I ordered chicken breast but they didn't have it so uh, I was glad that they had the beef and so we should be set for a while I told you guys the other day about our sweet gum tree issue if you we we aren't from the south although I don't know are these trees everywhere we've just never experienced them in the places we've lived but uh, here they are it's these little uh, spiky balls and uh, they're like seed pods I guess and they fall off the tree and we've got quite a few actually like the biggest one is actually our neighbor's tree and it falls in our yard but um, so they like fall on the ground and are all over the yard so I did some research and I got this picker upper thing that you roll on the ground watch I can it like goes inside but here's the thing I'm not sure about this thing because I did it and I did it like in this area I cleaned them all up but this thing filled up and there's not a good way to get them out. The directions show you just like spread open the metal things, but it took me, here's, here's what I picked up earlier, but it's a pain to get them out. Here, I, I don't know if I can do this one-handed, but you, you spread it open and, well, I don't think I can do it one-handed. And you get it out like that but when it's all full of them it was quite difficult to get them out so I'm not sure that I'm gonna keep this I may just use like the leaf blower and blow them to one side of the yard and scoop them up with a shovel I'm thinking that might be easier in theory this thing was pretty cool because it picked them up it's just the emptying of it so, I might be back to the drawing board. <gasps> There's a bird on the bird feeder. You guys want to see it? Hi, birdie. Are you enjoying your lunch? Is this lunch time for you? Bye-bye. I made soup in the oven today so i turned the oven on pretty low and i saw this idea on a new food channel i'm watching on youtube and it was for making broth but this time i made soup so i kind of broke what i was learning about but anyway we had a bag of what is it called coleslaw did i already vlog this i don't even remember so this bag of like coleslaw, you know, you add some dressing and it makes coleslaw. But it was a really big bag. So I thought, oh, I could put it and make some soup. 
And so then I did some freshly chopped carrots and celery and onion and then a can of tomatoes. So there's our soup. And then I added a little bit of brisket that was left over. So there we go. All right, sun is set. I just took a shower because I did some more yard work this evening. Guys, look, this little, um, here, let me focus in on here. This little area that you saw me working on, we're kind of mulching from here all the way to the back. And it's just under the trees. And um, it's, from here, it doesn't look that great. But it's starting, I feel like our backyard is starting to shape up, but in the midst of it, I like got into some vines and things and my arms were looking like an allergic reaction so I went and took a shower and I'll be done for tonight and I wonder if tomorrow's nice I'll probably work on it a little longer and uh, I don't know I'm, I'm enjoying the yard work and Ollie's enjoying looks like you enjoyed the hose didn't you buddy Quick question. yeah how is it so nice out here I know it's like 80 degrees, beautiful. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. I blocked him on because he kept stretching the hose. He stretched yeah. it all the way over here. Ollie loves the hose, so he kept picking up the nozzle and carrying it <laughs> across the yard. And I obviously gave him some water because he's covered. Did you have fun in the hose? Such a sweet boy. You are such a sweet boy. Oh, should we try the balancing thing? Wait, wait. Okay, get it. Oh, almost. <coughs> Hi. Hi. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I think it's like almost certain that my lungs are improving. Yesterday I was like, ooh, I think you're, you meaning my lungs, are not quite as bad as yesterday. And today I think it's like, oh yeah. I mean, I'm still having, you know, sections of the day that's like pretty intense coughing, getting mucus up, that sort of thing. So I'm definitely not back to where I was, but <clears throat> just a lot better than a week ago. Awesome. So I think that's really good. And I just ran around with Harry with that butterfly on the stick. Oh, really? Yeah, it was really fun. That's fun. Yeah. I just finished my vest, and I came downstairs, and I found my three boys, and they're so cute. They're Harry, cute. Harry has this ability to just paralyze you. <laughs> like, he gets on you, falls asleep, <laughs> and you just can't get up. I can, I second that. <coughs> How'd your best go? It went well. Good job. It's a beautiful night. Peaceful. Yeah, it is peaceful. I hope you guys are finding a smidge of peace in the midst of this chaos. And as, as always, always, we'll, we'll see, see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.